Maybe you need the roof that lasts a lifetime from Alcoa. Alcoa roofs are warranted for a lifetime to stand up to the worst of Florida's heat, rain, even hurricane force winds. Call your Alcoa franchise roofing dealer today. See you. Sonríe. Smile. In any language, a smile is beautiful. That's why a dentist should always protect your health. And why you should know about Bright Smile. As a hygienist, I'd recommend Bright Smile to anyone who wants a healthy, beautiful smile done professionally. To find out more about Bright Smile, call Dr. John Raffel's office today at 1-800-95-SMILE. Because a beautiful smile is always in style. Las Lanzas, painted by Velázquez. In Spain, making the world's finest olive oil is an art. Try Carbonell. We're sure you'll be inspired. Carbonell, the world's number one olive oil since 1866. Just a short trot from the Blue Ridge Mountains is a place that could send anyone's heart racing. But Charlottesville, Virginia is also a major financial center because it's served by Nations Bank, which gives Yancey Lumber the resources it needs to keep building its business, lets the Craddocks rely on the nation's number one bank for auto loans, and helps people at all stages of life rise above any financial hurdle in Charlottesville and in 1,900 other communities throughout our nation. Tonight on 7 News, first at 5 o'clock, an historic day in Haiti. After three years in exile, Jean-Bertrand Aristide is back in power tonight as president of Haiti. Joyous celebration in South Florida to commemorate this big homecoming. Live Team 7 coverage from Little Haiti to Port-au-Prince coming up. President Clinton making his way to Miami for a special visit. And new outbreaks of violence in the West Bank just one day after a kidnapping comes to a deadly end. I'm Lynn Martinez. And I'm Craig Stevens. 7 News, first at 5 starts right now live from South Florida's news station WSVN 7 this is 7 news at 5 o'clock Three years and 15 days after being forced into exile, Haitian President Jean-Bertrand Aristide finally returns home. Good evening again. Tonight, the celebrating continues from Port-au-Prince to right here in South Florida. It is a return many thought would never actually happen and possibly a sign of better times for Haiti as the United Nations just announces minutes ago that they are lifting the crippling economic sanctions.